hey y'all welcome back to my youtube channel <sighs> let me tell y'all something something i said that wrong it's all right though let me tell y'all something i tried to do uh i try i i done made two videos already just to get to this <laughs> this very moment and i didn't literally messed up my bus was coming so i had to hurry up i had to hurry up and stop the video so if i was to post that one y'all would just see that whole video and then y'all would see me screaming at the end because i was literally running for my bus but yeah but anyway y'all um how y'all doing today besides that how y'all doing today make sure y'all comment down below tell me how y'all doing and stuff like that and um tell me how y'all doing and um yeah and i hope that y'all all have a blessed and beautiful day and don't forget to tell y'all self that it's gonna be a blessed <laughs> wait that it's gonna be a black no it's gonna be an incredible week i'll be i'll be switching it up sometimes y'all i switch it up from time to time but um yeah but anyway i'll be switching it up from time to time but i hope don't forget to tell y'all self that it's gonna be an incredible week and it's gonna be filled with blessings that's what i meant to say and speak positivity over y'all life i do it all the time y'all i did it this morning i told me and alexander i'm like you're gonna have a good day at daycare i'm gonna have a good day at work i'm gonna have a positive attitude i don't care what customer comes in negative or with an attitude or anything i'm not gonna stoop down to their level i'm gonna stay positive i'm gonna have a great attitude i'm gonna have a blessed day you know and that's just them, them those are the things i tell myself and i tell myself i'm beautiful i tell myself i'm strong i tell myself all types of stuff so i encourage you guys to tell yourself that stuff as well it can be like it don't have to be exactly what i said but it can be anything anything positive just tell yourself that and actually believe and say it like i'm telling you i was telling my friend that i was like when you start to say stuff so many times and you tell it, tell it to yourself. After a while of you saying it, 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 it my bad, y'all. I'm getting mixed up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I told y'all sometimes when I'm talking too fast in my mind and my words are not coming out the way it's coming out of my mind. Sometimes I tend to stutter, but you know I'm gonna keep going because period, we not giving up. But anyways, as I was saying. The more we start to speak those speak speak those things into existence, the more they come true. So yeah, y'all, don't forget to speak positivity over y'all life. But anyways, as I was saying, y'all. Um. Oh, what was I finna say? Um. Oh yeah. Okay. So I never really, I never really know. No, hold on. So it's just me and my son at our house. Nobody else lives with us. Um, and I never really know, like I never really knew how it felt to live with, well, I, I lived with a few people before, like my mama and stuff like that, my mama and my brother. But I'm talking about like having your own place and having people over your place and actually enjoying those people's company and enjoying them and having fun. So let me tell y'all something. Um, if my if you watching this video, it's nothing negative. I'm not talking about you in a negative way. This is a positive thing, so don't get an attitude. But anyways, um, they end up coming over, y'all. They power end up going out. And this particular day, I was walking. So I was I had got off the bus, and it was like a storm or whatever. It was like some badass storms, and the power had went out. So when I was walking down the street, the first person I thought to call because my damn my uh it was the street was dark as hell, and me and Alexander was walking by herself. And the first person I thought to call was my mama because I'm like, oh no, like I know for a fact my mama gonna stay on the phone with me. You know she gonna stay on the phone. Something like other people. You know, other people care about me, too, and they love me, too. But it's nothing like your mama. Like, it's just nothing like that. So I called my mama. And my mama stayed on the phone with me until I got home because she knew that I was literally, like, I was just like, dang, like, it's dark and this street is black as hell. The tree didn't fell over. We walked over a extension line, uh, a cord, like an electric cord or whatever. 
Cause it had feel. Oh shit, feel this. It had feel and stuff like that. And yeah. But anyways, y'all. So yeah. And they end up coming over. I tell mom, I'm like, yeah, y'all can come over. Our power is not out. Y'all can come over. I don't mind. And I was excited, y'all, because I don't really have people over my house. I don't have, like, I don't be having people over my house at all. So I literally just be in the house chilling, making videos, staying to myself, talking on the phone to my friend. That's it, because I haven't really been talking to nobody else lately, which is not a problem. But I, I haven't been talking to nobody lately but my friend. That's it. And my mama. That's about it. But anyway, yeah. So they came over and stuff. I hurried up and I cooked some burgers for them. I love cooking, y'all. If y'all don't know that about me, I love cooking. And um, I hurried up and I cooked some food for them. Every single day of that week, y'all, I was cooking for them. And I never knew how it felt to do that until they came over and spent the week with me. They literally, they left that next, like that Sunday, that next Sunday. And they stayed over there for a full week. And I was happy to have them around. And I know I don't always get along with my mama, y'all. But I love her dearly. I love my brother dearly. I have to I have to interact with his um, girlfriend. Because you might as well just say we damn near a family now. Because she got a kid. She, well, she pregnant with my babies. No. Oh, shit. I said my babies. She's pregnant with my brother's baby. That's what I meant to say. But, yeah so i be happy to talk to her and stuff like that but it's no negative energy there like i don't feel no type of way towards her like i used to i kind of just let that shit go and i actually enjoyed them being over the, over at our house and stuff like that and it felt different because i haven't had nobody let me go say my bus and coming y'all but i haven't had nobody come over my house and actually spend like a whole week and three people like i like i haven't you know i never really like had that experience at my own house at somebody else's house yeah but at my own house no so experiencing that was i just liked it so yeah but anyway y'all oh excuse me i'm sorry anyway <laughs> excuse me <laughs> anyway y'all i'm goofy but um anyway y'all that was a good experience for me they definitely helped me clear out all my refrigerator like but it i still got food in there like i'm not saying that they ate all my food no they didn't do that like i was cooking for them and stuff like that i cooked some roast that was some that was some big that, like that roast was big as hell y'all big like and i'm like i'm happy i cooked that for them because if i would have just cooked that for me and alexander man when i tell y'all me and alexander would would look we would have ate all of that like no we would have just ate like two pieces that's it so yeah and i was glad that i got to experience that y'all and i told my mom i was like yeah i really enjoy having y'all over there and I'm glad that y'all was there and I'm glad that y'all spent that week with me. They were also helping me out. Like my Nate was taking out the trash. Uh well, yeah. Yep. And then like Renee was helping me with the dishes, like wiping down the tables and stuff. And they were just really like a big help. And my mama, because she knows that I have to go to school and to work. So she was helping me out she was watching alexander while i was at work and school and she was just really helping me out so i enjoyed them being there like i'm not gonna say that it was perfect because it, it was some things that you know happened that irritated me but that's okay but overall i can say i did enjoy my mama and i i'm just saying my family i did enjoy my family being at my house spending the night for that week i did enjoy that and i told them y'all better come back over because <laughs> but they already said that they would though they didn't left um some clothes and stuff over which i don't care about if they dirty when i go to the laundry mat i just wash them i don't care because no i ain't the type of person you can't leave dirty clothes at my house no you can i'll just wash them when i go wash them but anyway y'all yeah <laughs> So if this is, well, I'm going to just say this to anybody out there. 
if you ever get your own place or if you do have your own place already and you don't know how it feels to have a lot of people at your house because you're just so used to it being you and your kids or you and one other person then and you're just so used to that and now if you don't now if you okay with being alone if you just want it to be y'all then okay but if you actually like want to have somebody over there you want to be able to know the experience of certain things and how to do certain stuff and not all this and that then try inviting your family over or invite anybody else over me personally i have a friend but he don't even stay in detroit if he stay in detroit i would literally want him to come over every single day because we would just hang out and talk and you know just chill and stuff like that watch movies he's a good ass person he's chill like we talk on the phone all the time and yeah <laughs> But anyway, I actually got to call him after this video because I told him after I dropped Alexander off, I would call him. But yeah, I just wanted to make my video first before I called him because when we get to talking, me and him talk. Like, we have deep-ass conversations, and I really do appreciate that about our friendship. But anyway, y'all, yeah, besides him, and I have another male friend too, but I don't talk to him like that, but that's still my friend. When I go around him, I talk to him, but we not like i don't talk to him like every single day i don't know i really talk to him when i go over there i talk to him or when i'm on the phone with his mama i talk to him but till then i don't talk to him like that but um and yeah but that's still my friend though that's still my friend but yeah and then what other friend do i got i don't think i got no more friends y'all i don't think i got no more friends i don't so if you want to be my friend let me know let me know that you want to be my friend and we can become friends. Real friends, okay? Because I ain't, uh-uh. I didn't call people my friend that wasn't even my friend. So, yeah. But anyway, y'all, thank y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to have a blessed and beautiful day. And don't let nobody steal y'all joy. I'm going to say that one and last good time. This ain't going to be the last time I say that, but... <laughs> don't forget don't forget <laughs> i just keep what i just said anyway i'm funny like that anyway i'm funny like that anyway let me stop anyway as i was saying y'all don't forget to have a blessed and beautiful day please don't let nobody steal y'all joy um and don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and thank y'all so much for watching and i really do love and appreciate y'all